Forsaken City or is commonly known as FC, is a maze that gives players a chance at multiple desirable items such as incantation chests, sealed 45 equipment, refining gems, goddess favor, broken gems, universe purse, and more. It contains three floors, which are packed with undead monsters, treasure chests, bosses, as well as a final boss on the last floor. It's always recommended for any player to wishes to go to Forsaken City to be level 45, because this will provide the player with the most skill slash stat points available. In Canary I'll talk with Harbor Operator Tomas and click on Set Sail to go to the sea. Forsaken City 1 is the first floor of the maze. It contains the weakest monsters, one mini boss, and four chests. There will be always guilds fighting for drops and players farming monsters who are finding gems and broken gems so be careful. You have 40 minutes to kill a boss or else the portal to FC2 will be closed. After FC1 boss is defeated a portal will appear randomly at the four indicated points on the map. Reminder portal to FC2 won't appear if the boss hasn't been defeated. The Forsaken City 2 map is the same as the FC1 map. You will spawn randomly at any dock located at the corners. On this floor, you can find one mini boss, four chests, and three new monsters. After FC2 boss is defeated a portal will appear randomly at the four indicated points on the map. On this floor, you can find the final boss, four chests, and one new monster. This is the last boss of Forsaken City and the strongest one. Has two debuff skills, one that can immobilize and disable the players from using skills and attacks for 30 seconds and a poison debuff that reduces the player's HP constantly for 60 seconds. After an hour Forsaken City portal will close in sea and a new wave of mobs on land will spawn. Thank you for watching see you on the next video guide.